how would you feel if you were being punished for something that you did not do? Well, I bring you the story of the first ever recognized climate refugees from Nepal. Dhe is a small trans Himalayan village located in the Mustang district of Nepal. The earth that supported the lives of countless generations now stands barren. More than two dozen water sources have gone dry. 26 families had no option but to relocate somewhere away from their homes. Tasi Gaicho, a local resident, says they can't grow any greens from November to June. We want to introduce a solar-powered community vertical farm in this climate-affected village. The expected outcome of this project is to produce at least 25 kilograms of greens every day. This 100% pesticide-free and soil-free farming method will provide a nutritious supply of green vegetables, especially for the eight months when it's snowing outside. To obtain the same yield on land requires 95% more water and 80% more space. Supporting climate migrants and keeping them at a better place is the first step we can do to address climate change. We can all be a part of this noble initiative and let us do that. This is Pralisha reporting from Nepal for Climate Red TV.